Going to spend my last two days in Europe exploring Paris through the metro system and getting off and enjoying the beauties of this wonderful, amazing city. As this extensive metro system will literally take you anywhere you want to go. And in this video, I get off on many random exits and just enjoy the beauty in my last days in the Europe series. Welcome to the Europe series 2023. I'm Eric B from Travel Adventures with Eric B. If you're new here, I offer travel advice. I am a solo traveler and I do vlogs to help you travel better and more efficiently. Thing about this station that I haven't seen in a whole lot of the other stations, you have a free tour. Um, at first, I thought you had to pay for it, but I see it's absolutely free. Let's go see the Grand Palace. Yep, more construction work being done here, but that's the Grand Palace. I think the one behind it is what they call the Petite Palace, if I'm not mistaken. So, you want to see the Grand Palace? This is your exit. And it is raining. Champs-Élysées on the same exit as the Arc de Triomphe later. So the name that us Americans know well, FDR. Take the F9, we only got two exits to get off here. I know that that exit gave you that great view of the Eiffel Tower, so remember you can get off on this exit too and get a great view of the Eiffel Tower. I'm not sure how far the walk is from here. Tower is always amazing, but I've seen it so many times now that it's starting to lose some of its luster. So now I'm headed to the Free Art Museum here in Paris. The art Museum is free, we'll find out. It's directly across, I guess, at least view wise from the Eiffel Tower. Probably not directly across because. The Eiffel Tower is so big, you can see it. It looks like it's across the street, but it's probably like a 30-minute walk. show coming up and these are the stars like I have no idea no. <laughs> the museum is not open due to, to filming I guess these are the stars yeah, ask someone so this is a fashion show had no idea this was a fashion show, but they hang around a little bit longer than look for something else free to do. <laughs> a little more time than I wanted to, considering that that um, museum wasn't open, but I, I found it pretty interesting over there, though, even though I had no idea what I was going into, but I thought it was pretty cool, though, to actually see that with the people taking the pictures and the pap paparazzi and all. The common theme with the Paris Metro is, it's busy. It's packed like sardines all the time.
one thing I like about Paris a lot is that it's easier to find toilets than most of Europe. And you have like these. These are free and they're self-cleaning toilets. I said this before also in last year, one of last year's videos of Paris. You want to stay in the median in the middle right here when you're walking down this area off the Pigalle or the Blanche exit over here by um, Moulin Rouge because they got all these sex shops and strip clubs over here and you got to deal with guys trying to to sell you so you know oh well blah 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 you know all of that so yeah so got to stay in the middle because they're on each side Light out, folks. This might be a perfect spot to sit down and, and have have a little lunch dinner going on over there. But there's a lot of people there. And this looks good. And it's as good as it looks. Good stuff, people. Good stuff. And a great spot for lunch or dinner, I guess you would say at this point because it's getting late. Though it is starting to rain, as you can tell by the umbrellas from people. Now that's an interesting statue.
there, they were doing, they were getting along pretty well on the work for the cathedral, getting it back. I think it's supposed to reopen in 25, maybe, maybe even next year, correct me if I'm wrong. So, so the kind of work they're doing, hopefully we can see tonight. Here, now I'll see if I can see the sides of the building at least and, and get that on camera. I don't think I'm gonna get too close to it though in this weather. You just always been a tight of us. Cargo, my cargo 150 swiftly. I get Charles de Gaulle at Troyes confused with Charles de Gaulle International Airport. Charles de Gaulle at Troyes is close to the Arc de Triomphe, which we're going to walk to from this exit. It is not close to Charles de Gaulle Airport. It's the steps in the Paris Metro. It is not handicap accessible pretty much at all. Very few places here are handicap accessible. So for those of you wondering, what is the Arc de Triomphe? It is one of the most famous monuments in Paris. Honors those who fought and died for France in the French Revolution and the Napoleonic Wars. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I got soaked last night. It's starting to rain. It was supposed to be a very small percent chance of rain, but it's starting to rain a little bit. I got to go back in the metro station. I ain't getting soaked two days in a row. That's all, folks. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, I ask you to please hit the like, please hit the subscribe button, please hit the bell notification so you can know when I have more videos coming out. And as always, remember, live today, grow today, tomorrow's never guaranteed. Peace and travel, lots and lots of travel.